and welcome back to the Retime channel. Today we will be talking about oily skin and specifically what questions people might have about how to moisturize oily skin. Moisturizing your skin is very important even during summer days. As temperature rises, the production of oil also increases. And many wonder, do I even need to moisturize? So as someone who has been working in the skincare industry for quite a while now and someone who has tested a very big number of skincare products, we are here to share the best moisturizing products for oily skin type and the ways how to choose the right one. Yes, we will give you the lowdown on our favorite K-Beauty moisturizers that are designed for oily skin under $20. But before we begin with this video, please be sure to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to the Retime channel for contents like this every week. Let's get started. So the question of the day, do I still need to moisturize even if I have extremely oily skin type? Well, I'll go first because I'm not concerned by this category. I have very dry skin, so I can say that if I don't moisturize right after cleansing, my skin will be so dry, it will even be to the point of hurting. So if I don't have a very thick layer of moisturizer, even if it's lightweight moisturizer, I don't feel good. How do you feel about it since you have oily skin? Well, in my case, since I have an oily skin type, it gets extremely shiny and greasy during the day, especially during summer days. Although it doesn't give me an excuse to skip the moisturizing step of my skincare routine, I do need to be quite cautious about choosing the right product. Once again, moisturizing skin is extremely important and even more crucial for people with oily skin type. This is because skin feels the effect of the environment and therefore needs a moisturizer to help balance the loss of hydration. So the goal is to supply and retain water within the skin because dehydrated skin can lead to the overproduction of sebum and increase the oil level. So now that we've covered the basis, let's get into what ingredients are best for oily skin. Moisturizers contain humectants that are designed to attract water into the skin and they also have emollients which are designed to create a protective film around the skin to avoid any water loss. While humectants are usually suitable for oily skin, emollients are a little less popular in that area because of their slightly thicker composition. After all, the goal for oily skin is to find ingredients that will deposit moisture into it without necessarily increasing the oil levels. So how do we pick the right products? The most simple way to find those moisturizers is to look for keywords such as oil-free, water-based or non-comedogenic, which means that it won't clog the pores. It is important to note that while oil-free is usually seen as good for oily skin, some oils are actually beneficial to oily skin types. For example, squalene oil, it reduces inflammation and moisturizes the skin and now, so it doesn't overcompensate by producing too much sebum. Hyaluronic acid used on the light occlusive. Retinol, salicylic acid and niacinamide for their all balancing properties. Antioxidants also great to soothe the irritated oily skin. And finally, oats, the absorbed excess oil, help reduce the dead skin cells and signs of irritation. In K-Beauty, there are varied formulations of products, so it's very easy to find the right one for your skin type. As it is hot and humid at the moment, we wanted to help you find the best moisturizers that are lightweight that you can moisturize your oily skin with. We will show you our personal picks for the top moisturizers for oily skin in this summer weather. So our first pick is Cosarax Oil-Free Ultra Moisturizing Lotion. So I would recommend to use this product during the morning skincare routine due to its very lightweight consistency. It has a pump type applicator that is very comfortable to use and also hygienic. This product contains 70% of natural willow bark water for moisture restoration and maintaining the hydration level in the skin. It also contains vitamins, antioxidants and is hypoallergenic, so it's great for even sensitive skin type. So I really personally love the smell of this product. It has this kind of like mentally very fresh sort of smell, but if you're not a fan of smells in these types of product, you should probably skip it. It really is up to you. But we really love the fact that it penetrates the skin very deeply when applying it and it reduces irritation as well as bringing in moisture. So as for me, as you know, I have dry skin. This would probably not necessarily be enough on a daily basis. I would need to apply a thicker moisturizer probably on top of it. Our second product is from V-Grain 730 Daily Moisture Cream. It is formulated with arginine and spoline, which are known to bring moisture to the skin. This cream is great for restoring skin damage as it's loaded with antioxidants. 
It is also important to note that this lightweight, non-sticky formulation is vegan, cruelty-free and great eco-friendly option. It is great to use during nighttime since it has a bit thicker consistency compared to the Cosrx lotion. The best part of this product is the application part. It glides smoothly on the skin and instantly absorbs into its layers. It doesn't leave any oily or heavy feeling on the skin and also it's unscented so it makes it great for even sensitive skin. As for me, I mentioned earlier that I like a little bit of scent in my products, but that's fine. This one doesn't have a smell, but it is pretty hydrating and I feel like on the days where I'm feeling like I need to be active and I go outside, a lightweight cream like this one would probably also work for a dry skin type. The third product on my list is the Dr. G Already Blemish Clear Soothing Cream. This is probably one of the most loved skincare products here in Korea. This cream is popular for being quite soothing and its main ingredients are glycerin and niacinamide, which we have mentioned earlier. Not only does it hydrate the skin, but it also helps us balance out the oil levels just as well as it brightens the skin. One of the best features of its cream is the fact that it has this quite unusual texture that kind of sits kind of between a gel and a cream and it's very lightweight. And if you apply it after keeping it in a cool area, the soothing sensation is even more prominent. And of course, it absorbs and sets well into the skin. Right after application, this cream leaves slightly glowing finish. Personally, for me, the only downside of this product is the packaging because it's not the most hygienic option compared to all of the products that we have just mentioned. And last but not the least, my personal favorite Purito Deep Sea Pure Water Cream is the star product for oily skin types. Formulated with ocean water, which is rich in minerals, sodium hyaluronate, and niacinamide, it keeps the skin hydrated without leaving any sticky film on it. The texture of this product is gel-like, so it melts on the skin quite smoothly and leaves the skin refreshed. Now, to open a small secret of mine, I've already used four tips of this and I have two more at home. Whatever the skin type, not moisturizing is not an option. As your skin can easily lose hydration on various occasions, it is important to replenish it at all times. And that goes for any skincare routine. The key is to know what to look for. There are varied products available and suitable for any skin type and condition. So we hope this video was able to give you an idea of what you may need. But before you go, don't forget to click the like button and subscribe to support our channel. Also, turn on the notification bell so you never miss our videos. See you next week. Bye-bye.